Belichick and Ray Ferraro. I'm Mike Emery. And tonight we bring you two terrific teams for our contest. The contest tonight between Team Finland and Sweden. And as we approach game time, here's Eddie. I've been looking forward to this one for a while, Doc. Both of these teams have the ability to put the puck in the back of the net. Goaltending, as we know, could be the difference here. The Swedes win that neutral zone faceoff. Wonderful wrist shot. They score! And they've tied the game up. The goalie was surprised at how quick that snapshot got on him. Korpakoski is a goaltender that can be beaten up over the shoulders. He closes down the bottom of the net, Edzo, but this time they beat him up over his shoulders right near the elbow. And the faceoff's won. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a faceoff right near him. Fast save is a good one, but defensively, they cannot give up another odd man rush. And they've got it again. Directing that one to Lindstrom. He's got that centering pass. Goal! That's two unanswered goals. You want to score goals, you've got to get to this area of the ice. I think he believes he's got the whole net covered, Eddie, but he's left open the low stick side, beaten pretty cleanly. Sweden's ahead by one goal here in the first period. A lot of time still left to play, but getting one and breaking the tie was huge. Sweden's won that faceoff. They have it. Oh, what a great shot down there. Over six minutes to go here in the first. We had a tie game until just moments ago. It's a one-goal contest. Pinpoint pass up that right wing. On to keep it. Score! And the game is even. This is one shot I wish more young hockey players would use. Everybody wants to take the big slapper. It's not how hard you shoot it, it's how quick it comes off your stick. And that was quick. That's a really nice move, and then he lays this beautiful pass across the front of the net. And this is in the net. Finland's taking that neutral zone face off. Slid to keeping. Got his glove on it. First period over. Four goals scored. Two aside. Fans, take a look to the sky. The home team Zeppelin is loaded with prizes and in your way all intermission long. Keeping's goal has tied this game. Intermission is coming up. for a face-off coming up next. A player wants to get as close to the shot as he can so the shooter doesn't have any time to get rid of it. Standing up gets you there quicker. It's an excellent block. Good face-off win. He scores! The shooter had a couple of different options here. He could pass or shoot. He decided on the ladder and beat the goaltender clean. 
Edsel, the goaltender's too quick to rely on his technique. He drops down quickly. That opens up the top of the net, and too much room there for a shooter of this quality. Sweden's gotten a one-goal lead, and lots of time left in the game. We're still in period number two. He helps his team make progress with that bounce pass. Puts one on. And the net comes loose, so play is halt. Moved along and in. Stick handling failed a little bit there. Puck loose. Score! A goal for Team Sweden. The goal scorer put that puck in a shooting position, let it go, and beat the goaltender clean. Oh, he's done everything he can here. This is a desperation move. The puck is almost into an open net, yet look how close he makes it. Team Sweden's got a two-goal lead. Good time to have it. Late in the second period. What will they do next? What will be their mode of attack? And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. Forty minutes have been played here, and still more to go. A well-deserved rest is at hand. Don't forget to check out tonight's game highlights, post-game analysis, player interviews, and blogs on our team website. New content. Sweden's insurance goal has staked them to the two-goal lead that you would expect them to have. Here it is one more time. We'll return after these words. Has carried it through the middle. Gains the blue line. Let's a shot fly. He scores! Team Finland has connected. Kantos gave the goaltender no time to react with that quick snapshot. That sure is a miscue, Edzo, isn't it? The scorer's in front of the net. The defenseman's covering the blue line. Team Finland's goal gets them to within two. There is still time, thus there is still hope. It's a good thing. Point to point. That shot's blocked. Just a chop of the puck, and it's out of the way. And we get a penalty. The referee to the table, a player to the box. The Finns suffer a tripping call. This is an easy call for the official, Doc. Player made no attempt to play the puck and just tripped up the attacking player. Has it back deep. Referee over to the penalty box, and let's find out. The Finns see two up on the board against them for cross-checking. You want to see a cross-check? Look at the player's hands and positioning on his stick. Sometimes it's not what your power play percentage looks like overall. It's when the game is on the line, can you come through? They didn't. They missed right there. Great save. A whistle and a rest. Guys, bone jarring hit here. He was hurt immediately. If you have any chance in this game, you've got to put that one in. Not there. You talk about a heavy, hard shot. Unfortunately, just missed. 58 still on the clock. This is overwhelming to the half wall. Big save. Held there for a faceoff coming up next. We go down to the benches. It's Ray Ferraro. The Finns haven't helped themselves at all. They've had a lot of chances. No puck luck, but you've got to get the puck on the net when you're in the scoring zone. Let's it go. Good save there. The horn signals the end of the game. The clock at zeros. A two-goal victory. Anytime you can get that insurance goal, you can breathe a little bit easier as the time runs off the clock. 
So that is it for this one. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. For Eddie and Ray, Doc saying good night all.